Have you ever noticed that when you do a web search in AI like ChatGPT, it suggests some blog URLs like these? So basically, AI tools search the query in all the blogs written on that topic and serve you the simplified version. This is actually a new era of search engines. Let me give you an example of this. See this search result of ChatGPT on this keyword. I see the websites named Bluehost, Delicious Brains, WP Forms, Rapid Cloud, Neil Shafford, etc. Even Rapid Cloud is appearing multiple times here. Now, let's check the keyword in Google. This is the result. Shockingly, I see only WP Forms here, and other blogs are not even ranked in Google, but still ChatGPT is referring them. So what's the difference? Let me reveal the secret. Let's open a few links from here. Now edit the URL and add llms.txt after the domain name and paste enter. Let's do it for other domains too. You see, this is the thing .llms stands for large language models, and this is similar to the sitemap XML which we submit to Google Search Console. By the way, on some websites you may not find the llms.txt. Some might use alternative links. Here, these site owners organized their posts, pages, etc. for AI. In this new era, it's known as AI search optimization. And 99% bloggers still don't optimize their website for AI. Luckily, we don't need to do this manually if you are using WordPress, Rank Math SEO plugin already offering this to their users. So in this video, we will optimize our website for AI. Currently, our website doesn't have LLMSTXT. Let's go to the admin dashboard. My website is already using Rank Math. I use this plugin for all my websites for better SEO optimization. It always comes with the latest SEO features. Whatever, if you don't have that plugin, simply activate and complete the setup wizard, then go to the dashboard. and find LLMSTXT. Enable that. Then click Settings. Whenever you activate that, it will automatically create the LLMSTXT file. It included all the posts, categories, templates, etc. I prefer to add posts only and the important pages. Just disable all except posts. Now save it. And check. Only posts are now here. If you closely look at this structure, you will find the title, URL, and the meta description. It indicated to AI robots that these are the posts you have, this title, URL, and the brief of the contents. And if your website has thousands of posts and you only want to index your specific posts in AI, then you can disable the post too and add the desired posts manually in this additional content. And make sure you follow the proper structure for those posts. I'm using a shortcut method, just copying a sample to Notepad. Replace your desired URL, title, and modify the description. Now copy and paste it to that additional content section. Now save it. and let's check the LLMS file. See, only one post is here now. Another thing to mention is post limit. AI engine optimization is still in growing stage. Experts recommend using only selected posts in the LLMS TXT file, for example, 50 or 100, but the LLMS page should not be too large. So find out the dynamic contents and add them here. And if your site has around 100 contents, then just enable the posts and keep this blank. Allow the AI bot to crawl all posts.
So this is the video on how to index your website in AI search engines. If you find this video helpful, please subscribe to this channel. Thank you.